Good morning. It's early Wednesday and I'm out on the docks here before the guys get in and let's take a walk through the dock here and look at some sensational plants. First of all, let's take a look at this lavender. So here we're looking at uh, lavender grosso and these are 19 centimeter plants. Beautiful size to these, very fragrant. They're going to start to uh, pop some flowers here pretty soon. Exceptional value. So here we see some falls. Fantastic shipping out here and trees. You know, trees are a big part of the fall season. Everyone's getting uh, ready to plant those and here we have some gorgeous seven gallon limelight hydrangeas and uh, you know they're keeping them trimmed and cycled through you can see here they're just uh, starting to bud out which is perfect they're gonna bloom on the lots seven gallon hydrangea limelight and these are another extreme value here here's our 15 gallon weeping cherries we have a lot of great trees sevens all the way up to 45s exceptional values here beautiful plants for fall planting here I wanted to show you azaleas. We've seen a lot of azaleas going out on the dock. You know, we're thinking of those as spring. But if you're doing landscaping, we have a really nice crop of three-gallon azaleas. Here we're looking at a couple orders going out on these three-gallon Ilex Sky Pencil. Here we're looking at Hypericum. We have several uh, Hypericum in the series, but this is Red Star. And uh, you see the flowers are setting fruit. We'll see a really beautiful fall display. Here again, we're looking at our 25 gallon red maples. These are red sunsets, inch and three quarter, two inch. They're just gorgeous trees. Here we have an exceptional value is our uh, 15 gallon Texas Captains. And uh, hey, if you are doing landscaping, we've got a great price on these. Here we're looking at uh, Winter Gem. And uh, you know, these are sevens. Look at the size of this, guys. This is landscape quality at its best. Well, these are tied up, but I think you can still see the the nice 15 gallon magnolias here. And uh, this is a very popular plant in the spring and in the fall when people are getting those landscapes done. Here's another great color plant here. This is my Monet Wajilla, and a uh, very popular plant. It has a lot of great color and uh, it gets a sort of a tri color look to the foliage here as we get into fall. You can see they're just starting to color up. And uh, these are exceptional two gallons. More great landscape plants here. We're looking at three gallon uh, paniculata. This is Pinky Winky. And uh, you know, they're going through a rotational trim. They're just budded, not, not in flower. They're just starting to set bud. Here we're looking at our three gallon nest spruce. Look at the size of those. Daylilies are going strong. Here we're looking at uh, happy returns, but we got a great selection of daylilies. And they'll continue to bloom for some weeks to come. So here we're looking at grasses and uh, this is Miscanthus chrysillimus in a three gallon and then this is Hamlin. You can see it's starting to plume up. Exceptional values on the grasses and we got a great selection. Great grasses, uh, Carl Forrester, a very popular one. And then here we're looking at 19 centimeter Clematis uh, paniculata. And uh, here, let's zoom in here. You can see they're just starting to set bud. So uh, this is when you want to get them in. This is a fall blooming Clematis. We also have uh, one that's sort of a magenta to purple called Sweet Summer Love. Growers did an exceptional job on these seven gallon, uh, these are Syringa palabinina marirae. Look at this gorgeous seven gallon plant. Here we're looking at our seven gallon green mountains and man those are gorgeous. They trimmed them up very nice for you, good value on those. Here we're looking at our uh, one gallon pack of Sandra and uh, look at the value on that. Hibiscus, you know, we've got a great selection of uh, the perennial hibiscus. This is a Midnight Marvel and a 19 centimeter, that real nice, deep, rich foliage on them. And uh, we'll zoom in here. You can see they're budded. They're soon going to show some flower color. This is when you want to get them in, when they're nice, uh, nice, tight bud, getting ready to crack that color. Gives you a lot of shelf life to take you through that season. When well, we see the Caryopteris is another great fall color plant, and they're just starting to come into their own. You can see the buds coming on those, so if you don't have your caryopteris, think about those. Here we're looking at a fresh crop of Agilla spilled wine, and uh, you know, they're sheared up, flushing out, looking good. I have put one of these uh, two gallon, these are double knockouts, and uh, you can see here nice, tight, full plants. They're just tight buds, just starting to crack color. Again, perfect time for these. Two gallon, double knockouts. Well, here, if you're doing landscaping, I'll give you some price perspectives here and options. Here we have a one-gallon Carl Forrester against our three gallons. So two great plants, two price points for you for those landscape jobs. 
Look at the size of those Ramus fine lines. I mean, this is just an awesome plant. Every bit, 36 inch plus. These are gorgeous plants. Coming off of those uh, fine lines here, we're looking at a great fall color plant. These are two gallon magic carpets. Look at the size of these guys. So here we got a few pallets of these uh, hydrangeas, and this is uh, Paniculata Mystical Flame, and this is the Plants at Work group. You know, they're trimmed back, they're going to set bud here soon and be in color, but this is an exceptional value now. We got some good pricing on them. Here we have some uh, more of those um, hibiscus. These perennial hibiscus are just looking outstanding. So here we have Midnight Marvel, and again, you can see nice, full, gorgeous plants budded. And then this one is a new one from Proven Winners. This one's called Holy Grail. Um, very exciting. These are going to start to color up in the garden center and yards, and people are going to wonder where they're at. So you want to have them on your lots. Look at that perfect, nice, tight shape on these emerald green arborvitaes. If you're looking for a less formal, fast-growing hedge, you might want to check these out. These are our 15-gallon green giants. Here we're looking at some very nice uh, drift roses. Again, we got a great selection of roses available. The guys are doing split trim, so you got that color. And uh, this is variegated iris, you know, so they're done blooming, but they're still giving a lot with that colored foliage. Hey, if you're looking for a price point and a value, check out these three gallon bucks this winter gem. I mean, these are just gorgeous, heavy three gallon plants. You know, if you're looking instant effect, check out these three gallon ostrich ferns. You know, we got a great selection of ferns available, and uh, these are just stunning plants. Three gallon ostrich fern. In the background there, we're looking at aronia. You know, in aronia, we have several varieties. They're going to color up and give you that really awesome red foliage. And then here we have a great looking seven gallon uh, Ilex Galebra densa. And um, again, we have these beautiful sevens, and we have some really big threes as well. You believe that's a two gallon pygmy barberry? Wow, that's an exceptional value. More great uh, paniculata hydrangeas, and again, they've been trimmed back, they're starting to flush, those will be blooming here shortly. And that really nice orange color is Thuja Fire Chief. This is a really nice uh, arborvitae. This is a Thuja North Pole, and uh, this one has a really nice, strong, tight. Uh, habit to it. It takes that cold temperature. It doesn't get wind burn on it in the winter time. Uh, makes a nice tight formal hedge. Thuja North Pole. Well, speaking of Aronia, this is a newer one from Proven Winters and uh, you know it's a great looking plant here. This is Aronia Lowscape Mound. Shorter stature, still has all the white flowers, the awesome uh, red foliage and you know this is a great landscape plant for multiple conditions. Check this one out. Ronia low scape mount. You know, Budley is still showing a lot of great color and will all the way through to frost. And then over here we got a good selection of Budlia. And then here we're looking at the 19 centimeter ostrich fern. Look at that, man. Those are gorgeous. Here's another exceptional value. This is our three gallon, that's right, a three gallon Alberta spruce. These are every bet 24, 30 inch plants, and uh, they're great for fall. That will take you right into fall and also into the Christmas season because this would make a nice little Christmas tree on your lot too. Check this one out, 3 gallon Alberta spruce. Here we're looking at some 7 gallon Taxus densiformis, very nice full plants, good feather to them, nice value. Then we'll pan over here, you know we're looking at some Japanese maples, again a great selection on Japanese maples from 3's to our 25's. Hibiscus is still just going like crazy, man. We have a lot of nice full plants here, as you can see, loaded with buds. Had to pull one of these off the pallet. Nice color, beautiful size for these three gallon mop cypress. Let's pan over here. This is another real hot one. This is hibiscus, a little shorter statured plant. This is little chem. And you can see here, loaded with buds. Oh my goodness, that's going to flower like crazy. You check out the size on these three gallon blue Pacific juniper. Two staples on the dock here. We're looking at a grass. This is a proven winter called Cheyenne Sky. And it's starting to color up, getting those hues of deep burgundy. Next to them, we have Mr. Bowling Ball. You know, the growers have done an outstanding job on these three gallon PJM elites. Look at the gorgeous color on that Miscanthus variegated. And you know, we're still looking at Emeracalis, and these are just awesome. These are Carex Everest. What a value on those guys. Beautiful color. 
Here we're looking at uh, Liriope Silvery Sunproof. Again, very nice full plants, great color. Pounding over here, we're looking at Syringa. This is Blue Meringue Dark Purple. Again, very nice heavy full plants. Hey, landscapers, if you want a great value, look at this one. This is a three gallon microbiota Celtic Pride. Exceptional plants. Every bit 18 and 24 inch. Good value on these. A very popular plan here and this is uh, Sierra Spreader and uh, very nice full junipers. Another exceptional value in ferns. This is a 19 centimeter ghost fern. Big beautiful plant. Check out these. These are our uh, green velvet seven gallons. Here we're looking at another spirea. This one happens to be uh, double play big bang. You know spirea can be an awesome summer uh, and fall color plant because it's got this really nice chartreuse to almost hues of copper in it. So this will take you right through the season here. Exceptional big plants, good for your fall's fantastic displays. Here we have an entire semi that just came in of our beautiful fall seasonal color and these are our uh, uh, shaded garden mums, our cabbage, kale, um, Exceptional nice big plants here. We'll take a look at those as they get them unloaded. Check this out. This is a quart cabbage. Can you believe that? I mean, wow. So here we're looking at our aster crop, and it's about a week out, so they're nice, tight, full plants, tight budded. We start start seeing those swell up and, and cracking a little color in the next week to ten days. But uh, they're hitting the inventory and they look great. Hey guys, I'm out walking this crop and uh, these are the court cabbage and kale and again you'll see those on the, the dock video but look at the awesome size on that, what a value. And here we're looking at our court mums, you know these are shaded mums, you can see the nice buds coming out on these, they're going to look sensational, give you a lot of shelf life and a lot of color. So I'm out in the greenhouse and I wanted to show you how we're doing our pictures and you know if you go to our website up in the upper right hand corner you'll notice that we've got uh, a few hundred web picks that we're keeping you updated on what the crop looks like. So I'm out in the mums and here we're looking at key lime just to, as a sample and uh, you'll see here these are gorgeous big mums. Look at the value on those guys. So again you're seeing our shaded mums and you know these are timed out. We have six crops and uh, currently I just want to show you they're big plump buds haven't started cracking color but these are oh about three to five days from starting to crack that color so uh, you know and we're shipping them very quickly so we've shipped several crops out of here and uh, you can see the size of this plant I mean it's just gonna explode in color and you can see how fast these mums are going out uh, we got racks of them going out on the dock today the guys are just now getting ready to pull uh, this afternoon's loads as you can see here nice big full heavy plants look at that gorgeous order of the mums cabbage and kale going out here you can see uh, these shaded mums are really going fast so be sure to get your order in well hey that's a quick walk through the dock today I think you've seen a lot of great looking plants we have uh, really good color with our flowering shrubs perennials great evergreen sized plants for landscaping and our trees are just looking sensational be sure to check with our sales team geez I hope we're loading this truck for you